a dozen urgent messages while you dithered about. Ooh. Jesus. How can I help you? How large are the facilities here? We have 17 research complexes built into the mountains. Each is a self-sufficient facility housing a staff of hundreds. Tell me about the companies that work on Novaria. Over 250 high-tech firms rent our labs. Major shareholders include Elanis Risk Control Services, Binary Helix, and Synthetic Insights Limited. Your guards work for ERCS, don't they? The executive board gets a discount on facility security. Elanis also develops lethal and non-lethal weapons. Binary Helix, they work in genetics? BH is a leader in genetics and biotechnology. They try to keep a low profile in the media. Much of their research is in biotic modifications. That angers many Luddite, organic baseline, and fundamentalist groups. Haven't I seen synthetic insights in the news lately? They're one of only four corporations licensed by the Citadel Council to develop artificial intelligence. They attract many protests. No agitators have ever breached our security. That's why they invest heavily here. Cool. I've taken up enough of your time. Not at all, Spectre. This is my job, after all. Got new armor? Yep, we uh, got Garrus some better armor. It's actually really good uh, stats on it as well. But now he no longer has the space janitor armor. <laughs> I'm sure he's very happy about that. Right, this guy probably won't do business with us anymore. Greetings, Spectre. Have you brought the package? Hmm. I'm just browsing right now. I don't think it's I want to tell him that the job is done and it's not done the way he wants it. Otherwise, he'll probably never do business with us. And I'd like to buy things from him. Okay, so now that we've spoken to Analeus... There's an area down here we can go. Oh, this is the way to the garage. Yeah, that's me. I used to be a military tech. Except for my ego's people, everyone's too corporate here. They just sit around sipping expensive water. So what can I do for you today? You seem like you have an ear to the ground. What's happening around here? There's the problems up on Peak 15. Synthetics Insights was shut down by Analeus. And a matriarch came through. Do you know where that matriarch is now? You looking for her? She took a shuttle to Peak 15 before we lost contact. Hmm. What sort of problems are there at Peak 15? Don't know. There's a blizzard up there, but we've had those before. Never cut the satellite uplinks before. 15's always had a lousy reputation. Nobody talks about what they do there. And everyone sent up comes back a little quieter. What was that about synthetic insights? Scuttlebutt says Lord Keen was on the take. Zainalea shut down SI's offices, quiet like, so no off world lawyers come in on it. What do you do here? I'm the chief mechanic for Hanshan. Just call me Lee. Humans have a problem saying my full name. Got it yeah, I wonder why. Me, keeping the shuttles coming and going. I was gonna take a stab at it when I saw the nameplate, and I was like, nah. Not even. Not gonna try that. Um. Hey. How can I get into the garage? You need a pass. You can get one from Analeas for the managers. If you can polish enough gizzard. Maybe you could let me borrow yours? Sure. If I wanted to lose my job and get sued into the next spiral arm, security tracks card use. 
I have to go. You need anything? I'll be here. Well, apparently not, because you won't give me your card. But we know we can get one. Access to the garage is restricted. I'm on Citadel business. I need to leave the station. If you want to enter the garage, you need authorization for Mr. Analeas. No exceptions. I'm sorry. Hmm. Where does this go? What if this leads to Synthetic Insight's office? Why would they have so many windows if all they see outside is snow? Maybe they like looking at snow. I don't know. Freeze! Henshan security. This office is sealed. What are you doing in these offices? The administrator's orders. Laura Keen is under investigation. Analeas is paying you to shake this place down. Does Captain Matsuo know you're here? Hey, I'm not the one who wants Keen. Analeas has a varin up his ass about this guy. How about this? You pretend you didn't see us, we'll pretend we didn't see you. He's a good girl. As for the rest of them, though, they're actually going to come and uh, try this. Oh! Oh! Yeah, I think this shotgun right now is the way to go. Oh, no evidence. I mean, it's the way to go when you actually hit them. Area secured. Cool. Damn, that's brutal. Ah, that's the way to go. Let's check this out first. What's over here? Stuff and things. I like stuff and things. Take them all. Hey, okay. none of those are open. I like how the speech check we got at the beginning of this area is basically, do you want to kill two more people or not? Like, well, you know, save the bullets, I suppose. Evidence downloaded. Quick save. Ah. Oh, look who it is. Hi. I don't think you're supposed to be in here, Shepard. Neither are you. Yeah, who are you again? Oh, you were the one who acted really snotty with us at the dock. No, I'm not. Are you? I'm Sergeant Kyra Sterling. Ilanis risk control not what I services. asked. Analeas would throw you off world for what you did here. I won't. You know what we did to cop killers on my world? Your men are dirty, Sergeant. You're here off duty breaking the law for bribe money. I didn't want to fight them. They fired first. Well, I don't need a gun to rip you to pieces. Apparently you do. Oh, ow. No, 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 no. Let me finish up. There we go. Ah. All right. Some of that. Oh, we just destroyed these guys. 
You got up close with a sniper rifle. Yep. I think we're good, Shepard. Yep. That's one word for it. Oh, really? I mean, I guess that's what it is. The melon soda one is as well. Nope. Nope. Yes! There we go. Did it come in one of those glass bottles with, like, the little, um... Like, stop a ball at the top? Is it one of those types of bottles? Because those are the ones that I can get from the, um, uh, the Japanese grocery store that I sometimes order stuff from. They sell those little glass bottles where you, like, push down a little uh, glass bead at the top, like, as a stopper, and then it goes underneath a uh, thing in the glass, like a little, uh, little ridge. Never trusted those. <laughs> you know you're halfway through drinking and it always comes free and just like Bum. Yeah. Well it won't actually come out, but you know. Commander, there have been reports of noise from the Synthetic Insights office. Would you know anything about it? Don't be coy. Speak plain. What's your interest? Not here, Spectre. Meet me at the hotel for a drink before you talk to Keen. I'll be waiting. Oh really? Well then. Intrigue. And deception. Somebody on fire there? Who's on fire? Allow me to reintroduce myself. Parasini, Novaria Internal Affairs. Okay, and what do you want? What do you want? The executive board knows about Analeas's corruption. I've been undercover for six months. I want you to convince Keen to testify before the board. With his evidence, this planet can run profitably again. Hmm. You work for Analeas. Can't you just take his records? <laughs> He's a crook, not a moron. He doesn't keep logs on his computer saying, This month I stole three million credits. Keen's testimony and records are everything I need to prove Analeas' guilt in one package. Hmm. Why don't you ask Keen directly? I'm Analeas' secretary. You'd think he'd believe me? That he'd meet me in some dark alley with his evidence? I thought corruption was the rule on Novaria. The rule is don't rock the boat. Self-interest is tolerated if it doesn't interfere with business. Analeas is driving customers away. Hey, the Holy Bow, congratulations on the battle royal win. Well, I need King's Pass. I need King's Garage Pass to complete my mission. You help my investigation, I'll provide whatever you need. Favor for a favor. Analeas is dirty. It might be best to help her. Look, Shepard, I don't like this either. You specters play fast and loose with the law. That's bad for business. What's happening up on Peak 15? Before the weather closed in, hand Oh, it's kicking ass today, yeah. Code Omega means a terminal breach of safety protocols. No one goes up until the crew sends an all clear. 
That doesn't tell me much. That's all I've got. No one knows what's going on up there. Hmm. And if the crew never sends an all clear? The executive board votes whether or not to destroy the facility. One antimatter warhead from the battle stations vaporizes all contaminants. Wow. Okay. How can I get to peak 15? The shuttles are down, so you'd have to drive up. If you get keen to testify, I'll get into the garage. Do you know why the matriarch is here? Something to do with Peak 15. She arrived after we received their Code Omega, automated warning of a containment breach. She came with an escort of Asari commandos. They took the last shuttle up to Peak 15 with a load of crates. Hmm. Do you know what she had in the crates? No idea. The commandos wouldn't let anyone near them. They seemed heavy, though. All right, well, I'm going to help them. All right, I'll talk to Keen and see if I can convince him. Thank you. You know where I work. Come talk to me once you know if he'll play ball. Always a pleasure, Spectre. Any news on that matter I asked you to look into? Hmm. I need to get up to peak 15. Indeed. That might be difficult. A terrible storm has been unleashed up there. I don't think he's talking about the blizzard. Are you referring to the blizzard? Of course. What else would I be referring to? I heard there was an accident. There have been unseemly rumors circulating along the lines of ancient evil and plague from distant suns. <laughs> Amusing, no? Someone watches too many bad horror vids. Did you see an Asari matriarch recently? Yes, she caused quite a stir. It's not every day a matriarch arrives with a guard detail of commandos. Is it so unusual to see a matriarch? They rarely venture beyond Asari space. To see such an esteemed figure is surprising. Lady Benezia was also dressed for her role. An Asari in a pinstripe suit set tongues wagging among the younger male employees, so to speak. Young men have funny ideas of what Asari are like. I blame the extranet and computer games. Don't go blaming computer games there, Ash. Nothing wrong with games. Armed commandos were allowed on Novaria? I don't know if they were disarmed. Of course, one can't confiscate biotic powers. Saren, and by extension, Benezia, is an important person. By that More I reasons to kill her off. Sell stock, if denied. You know why Benezia is here? She claimed to be Saren's assistant, here to get a certain project back on track. I suspect she meant Peak 15. Hmm. I have a different question. As it says, the woman in the computer games. Oh. I should write a book about it while I have the time to spare. I finished the job, but an internal affairs investigator contacted me. She wants you to testify against Analeas. Now that you have my property, you want to dictate how I use it. I have no interest in a public spectacle. Everyone on this station is chafing under Analeas's extortion. You might end up a hero. My employers rely on the goodwill of the executive board to work here. The board is investigating Analeas. They'll be more angry at him than at you. All right. It is obvious that I cannot dissuade you. Very well. I will testify. Make whatever arrangements you need with your contact. I will wait here. Cool. Okay, before we go, we're going to do this little conversation game over here. Any results? Brief me. Tell me what you know about Vargas. Please change, because damn. He is impatient with those who waste his time. I tried to get him distracted and off topic. He concluded I was not interested in his company's services. I noticed he has a tell. When a topic makes him nervous or uncomfortable, he has a tendency to rub the back of his neck. If you see that, press him on the subject. It may distract him enough to keep him talking. Okay, so when he does this, we should, you know, really dig into what he's do what he's talking about. Anything else? Tell me what you know about Vargas. 
He is impatient with those who waste his time. I tried to get him distracted and off topic. He concluded I was not interested in his company's services. I noticed he has a tell. Mm. When a topic makes him nervous or un if you see that, press him on the subject. But don't go off topic. It may distract him enough to keep him talking. We'll talk later. And press him whenever he rubs his neck. Okay. What's up, dude? Can I help you? Mr. Vargas, I'm Commander Shepard. Bait that hook. I understand you work for Binary Healer. Nice and chunky. That's correct. Rafael Vargas sales. Were are you interested in our services? I am. It's customary to perform minor genetic upgrades upon enlistment. I've been assigned to see what BH has to offer. It was my understanding that the Citadel contracted to a Solarian Corporation for its enhancement programs. I'm sure you know that we pass a new budget every fiscal year. If it delivers a better soldier, contracts can change. A sound business practice. Excuse my hesitation, I've never heard a government accused of good business sense. First, the boilerplate disclaimer. No genetic enhancement is guaranteed to take. We can maximize the odds, but every strand of DNA is unique. Our patented techniques can provide an 8% improvement in adrenal response, 12% faster clotting, and a measurable decrease in CG muscle degeneracy. Hmm. What about pain immunity? Is it possible to deaden pain somehow? What? Why, uh, we, we could try to make the skin insensate, I suppose. Full body numbness, atrophy out all the nerve clusters, you'd still feel internal injuries. But that's dangerously close to genetic engineering, Shepard. The laws only allow improvement of natural functions. We can't add or remove. Interesting. I can get you those improvements for 30k credits per head. For a bulk order, I can work in a sensory enhancement package, guaranteed 2015 vision and hearing from 12 to 22,000 hertz. Mm hmm. Seems rather high. Are you sure that's the best price you can offer? Absolutely. That's the standard rate. Of course, if the government moves forward with this on an official level, there might be some additional discounts. That's better. I have to admit, it surprised me that you're here for business. There are many development projects on Avaria, some not entirely legal. Um, I can't do any of these. We really need high charisma, don't we? Hmm. Does Binary Helix have any less than above board projects? I'll keep my source confidential. Certainly not. Our corporate reputation is sterling. I can assure you all of Binary Helix's operations on Novaria are strictly on the level. The beep happened, it worked. Oh. Sounds like my crew needs me for something. I'll be in touch. Of course, Commander Shepard. We look forward to doing business with the Citadel. Yeah, we got him. Any results? Your toy did its job. Excellent. I will transfer 500 credits to your account. Oh, come on. You can do better than that. Only 500. All right. I thought you might have wanted to provide more. Since you couldn't do it yourself, I mean. Did I say 500 credits? I meant 750. That's better. Good day, Spectre. Nice. All right. Let me just check a few things. Uh... I do have two points to spend. I think I just want to get these last charm points. Just get them out of the way, then they're done. Did Ash upgrade anything? Adrenaline burst. Garrus, did you get better armor yet? He's still not putting points in his armor. Hmm. Damn, the Holy Bow caught another star. What the heck? Well then. Must be all that holiness. Never apologize for being the most successful person. <laughs> yeah, I just let them level up on their own. I can't be bothered to micromanage it. But Garrus is not choosing medium armor and that's beginning to get annoying.
That's it, yeah, Alchemist has food, so... You know, we've all got something. Feel free to get those stars. But we're gonna go and see about... ...getting Analeas deposed. Spectre, have you given any more consideration to my offer? It took some persuasion, but Keen has agreed to testify. <sighs> That's a world of stress off my back. I'll take the evidence for safe transport. Oh, <laughs> I didn't think you. No, you're me. the star. Specter and all. I guess some of you can be all right. So, how about getting me into the garage? While you were working on Keen, I got you a garage pass. Be careful up there. That's it, except for Shy. She's I the dragon. I have rest to make. Wish I had time to change into something easy to move in. I hate skirts. This is an outrage. I'll see that you never work in this sector again. Yeah, yeah, get a move on. You, Shepard! I demand you place this bitch under arrest! You have the right to remain silent. I wish to God you'd exercise it. See you around the galaxy, Commander. I owe you a beer. That's two people that owe us a drink now. Nice. We're getting somewhere. I feel important. I now bust into his office and, uh... I just shut the door. Okay. Oh god, it's try I'm trying to walk while I'm doing this. That is weird. Okay, these sentry turrets are really crap. Didn't stop me breaking into the guy's safe. Alchemist is some form of sentient fire. Definitely. Well, look, if we're going to go confront Benezia, we need to go and um, get Liara on the squad. We go back to the ship. And we can like, leave the ship again. The new crew. It'd be nice if you could just open a menu and say, you know, like, yeah, I'm, I'm going to send someone back to the ship, send a different person. Commander, I'm glad you stopped to talk. Yeah, I'm sorry, I, I killed a bunch of your people. How fortunate it was that Analeas Sama was caught with his hand in the cookie jar. Rest assured, I bear you no ill will. Uh, what are you um, finding unfortunate? That he was caught, or that he had his hand in the cookie jar? Doesn't sound like you disapprove of his actions. The executive board is not concerned with galactic law, Commander. That's why this planet was settled, after all. As far as they are concerned, Analea Sama went too far. On Ovaria, you may do what you wish, so long as you do not disturb public order. I only request that you limit the number of disturbances you provoke. I would consider it a favor. I don't intend to make life difficult for anyone. I appreciate that, Commander. If you will excuse me, I must file reports on this incident. Good day. Hmm. But honestly, your second in command, she had it coming. So, you know. Yeah, except that guy. Screw that guy. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination. Logged. The commanding officer is aboard. Exo Presley stands relieved. Cool. Um, we need to do anything while we're here? Probably not. We just need to leave again. And this time we'll take Liara, and we'll definitely take Garrus, I think. Yeah. 
equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. So... It just t tell me I have too many the items? The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. 